please welcome Tom Ryan, everybody. I've always wondered how the Morton Salt Company makes any money. How long does it take you folks to go through one of those big blue drums of Morton Salt? Five years? What'd you pay for it? Quarter? Oh, they're just raking it in. I mean, even if you're a lifetime customer, they're gonna make, what, three bucks from you? If they do everything right. Because really, in the last five years, I've had three cars, four apartments, one Morton Salt. And I didn't even pay for it. It was handed down to me from my grandmother. That metal chute was a little damaged. So I had to take it into the Morton repair guy. 30 bucks. That's how they're making their money. I think the people at Arm & Hammer Baking Soda used to have the same problem. Because we were using, what, about a teaspoon a year? of baking soda at the most. So they got together, they had a meeting. They said, let's see, what can we tell them to get them to use more baking soda? They must have been really drunk. I got a good idea. Why don't we tell them you can put it in the refrigerator? It'll take away the odors. Oh, that's good, man. That's real good. I got a better one. Why don't we tell them you can brush your teeth with baking soda? Oh, what the heck? Why don't we tell them to take the whole box and just pour it down the drain? <laughs> Remember that commercial? They actually told us to pour it down the drain to help keep the drain smelling clean and fresh. No other American company had that kind of nerve. And we believed them. We're over there, really? You buy it, then you pour it down the chain? All right. Oh my God, it's empty. We need some more. There's some in the fridge. Get it. Helps keep the drain smelling clean and fresh. How often have you walked into someone's home? Oh, man. Is that your drain? You're going to need at least two boxes. Thank you very much. Very funny. Nice meeting you. Tom Ryan, everybody.